Good morning, Colossus Fitness. I'm back at you. I have no memory card for my G7X. Uh, Kyle is a good camera, so I'm just out here on iPhone like the old days. I'm going to start it off showing you my go-to breakfast every morning. It's so good. Check this out. So the reason I eat this is it's packed, packed, just good oatmeal, nice carbs, it's nice and set, I'm getting my apple in, just some simple sugar, some simple glycogen in my system, especially if I'm about to hit them heavy squats, I like having a little bit of cinnamon, has some thermogenic effect there, um, and then I put the protein in, the HP tastes amazing, it actually complements the oatmeal, so it's something I really like to do, and then I make my coffee, and then I'll usually have my aminos. Then I'm going to get ready to go crush those squats. Kyle's been killing it, so that's my new coffee maker. We picked him one up too, so I'm going to surprise him with it. Let's see what he says. Jeez! Got to go with that Tim Hortons, that Canadian pride right there. Timmy's bud. This guy's going to be so fired up. Yo, bro, got you a little present. It's a bit chilly, eh? You got it? Keurig, bro? No way. Look at the size of that sucker. What? You like my camera? Yeah, nice phone. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. Bro, it comes with some Timmy's. Got Kyle's Timmy's been killing too? the editing, too. He deserves it. Oh my god, dude. Yo. Let's go. Thanks, bro. That's a start. It's going to be unreal, man. My motivation is going to be up so much. Bro, let's squat it out. Holy. What's up, guys? This should be a lot better. All right, let's kill our squats. So we go to the gym 15 minutes early, it's closed, so we figured we could sit in here like idiots. We could start getting changed because it takes us friggin' forever. Putting on these stupid shoes, sliding up these knee sleeves, so we can walk in, hit our squats, leave, and then we can kind of have like a more fun, pumpy bro workout later in the day. So yeah. Time is money. Yeah, bro. Let's, uh, let's start the stretcher, get her going nice and early. I actually feel pretty live. That hazelnut coffee is mint. Honestly, I don't like flavored coffee, but that stuff, she does the job. We're the only ones here. For once, we don't have to worry about anything. <laughs> Woo! Woo! All right, so this is the first week of the second block. So we actually did an extra two weeks on the first block. So this would be our seventh week we've been running here, uh, which means we are 11 weeks out. This is a ton of random dates but yeah we're about 11 weeks out squatting nice and heavy this is our last squat session of the week we're doing three right now and we're going for 85 percent four by four kind of heavy kind of not but we're strong from that granola so we're laughing well oatmeal but doing well dog yeah being on my yeah me yeah. Fast as it'll be for this time of morning. It's 8 a.m. I could be sleeping. Sleeping one off, you know? Kind of be up till 3, sleep till 12, and instead I'm squatting 475. Let's get it. Doing well, dawg. You not from the city, I could tell, I could tell, dawg. Did it, did it, did it by myself, by myself, dawg. Blew up and I'm in the city still, I'm still here, dawg. How did I finesse all of this shit from Jane and Weston? How did that feel? It is weird with the mirror, I, I'm not used to that. I was looking at myself way too much and kind of throwing myself off.
kick in, this guy doesn't even have clips on. See? Yeah. This is the problem. 97 people would hit the third, think they're tasks there, like me, but I could honestly probably get six or seven. You really gotta learn to grind, especially if you wanna get into powerlifting. First one, I was parallel, but I wanted to go even deeper. Being that OPA death, so sunk him a bit more and it felt nice. <laughs> Let's go, buddy. That set was way better. Gotta get intense, man. Squats are done. We're actually gonna be heading to London and we're gonna take you through a carb refeed. We like to try to do it at home because we can like minimize the fat, but we're actually gonna show you guys what we're gonna eat for the entire day while hitting high carbs and low fat. Let's get it. Bro, low carb at McDonald's? I mean, low fat, is that even possible? Uh, could they be with milk exclusively and like not with cream? Thank you. Can we do it? Yeah. Let's do it. And then can I get two large smoothies too, please? Mango? Oh no. Then again. Yeah, what happened? So, first off, I save up the McDonald's. In Canada, each time we get a sticker. So, like this. So, I save these up, and instead of getting just a coffee, you can get any drink. So I get Americano, and that's actually a ton of fun. I look forward to it. She processes me through whatever, right? And then I go, okay, I want that, and I want smoothies. Then after, like four minutes after, when we paid and everything, they go, yeah, we don't have any of those. So I just get these normal coffees. I wasted my stickers, and we wasted money, but friggin' McDonald's. A Boston cream. And then could we get two real fruit chill mangoes, please? That's smooth. One, but it's kind of still. I usually love these things, but I'm a little disappointed. But what can you do? Buy fat. I'm taking my bite here, but I enjoy this. And that's what the repeats for psychological as well as physical. It's my chance to have a donut. Way you're going to recover microcycle to microcycle actually stay within your strength MRV and that optimal zone of development. If your goal is hypertrophy, uh, then you can do much more and still benefit, and your strength may be a little bit down usually, but it's not a big deal to you because that's not your primary uh, goal in training. And we see this ecologically if you take a survey of bodybuilder versus power. Carbs, baby! Middle Eastern food is the bomb because it's a bunch of bread. Bunch of like chicken and beef and a bunch of vegetables. And that's literally all you need. Hummuses and stuff. It is so mint. We have to stay away from that because of the refeed. But this is gonna be a good time. You guys go. What? Oh, dude, I was I so know. scared. You not from the city? I could tell. I could tell, dog. Did it, did it, did it by myself, by myself, dog. Blew up and I'm in the city still. I'm still here, dog. Oh. filming me because I'm going to the Congo for an African lion safari and we're just we're chronicling it, you know? Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Excited? I am. I don't want to get eaten by a lion though, so I need to get muscular like him from all that food and I'll be good to go. Oh yeah. What would you like? And the barbecue beef strip loin. Okay. Could we get that with all chicken? Alright, so I told him about this place. Uh, Olivia showed me my girlfriend Claus Fitties. So it's sick. Like they have this cool bread that'll come out, you'll see it, but it's always funny when you're showing like your friend a restaurant or whatever, like you hype it up so much and you're like, bro, this is the place, this is the place. And you don't want to under deliver. So I, I usually don't do that, but with here, like, he's gonna like it, yo. Like this, this is what's up and we can just kill this bread. They keep bringing it out. So it's just as much as we can handle, carb up, get it done. It's gonna be a good time. It's a little expensive, but for the unlimited bread, like this will legitimately restrict the amount of places we have to go so much. Yeah, I agree. Look at this, bro, and the bread just came out. It's fresh and hot. How is it, bro? Dude, I need to eat. These it's carbs just like, are just so you can't like... even stress how good this bread is, though. She brought us both one. Like, we got hooked up nicely. This cut has been getting serious, so this carb refeed is gonna be amazing. Like, I'm so excited to eat this. I've never been so pumped. So 
So we got these little zero calorie gems. It tastes identical to actual iced tea. So we're indulging in a southern pleasure with modernized aspartame foundations. Pleasant peaches. Out in this bar here, it takes me a while. That's what Kyle's laughing. Cause he's a bully. I don't believe in bullying. Hi, Emily. Hey, this mm. is all I wanted was just a little, little bit of bacon. This is the real MVP, though. I've been thinking about rotisserie chicken since like Nam. <laughs> Let's go, come on, get it, get it. How many was that? Eight. Holy crap. Eight time nine maybe, but I don't feel like breaking my back. Alright, so after missing 520 twice on my last comp, super ecstatic about this. It's projecting me out at 565 conservatively for the eight. I think I could have gotten nine, which would have been a 585 PR. I know that's very high. I'd really just like to be able to hit. I'm about 197 pounds, that's my lowest true weight. But if I can come in provincials, I really want to get top five there. I'm going to need at least a 1500 PR if I want to contend, so I'm just going to out here grind, stick close to that MRV and just push myself every time. Or 12? Huh? 11 or 12? I think that was just 10, but I had more. Oh. I was like, alright. It's just, honestly, I feel like we could do more, but this high rep is weird, but we're getting used to it. Wow, 10 with 345. I'm happy. Yo, bro, let's show them what's good. <laughs> you got to shock the muscle, shock the muscle, and shock the muscle.